hello guys how you all doing i hope you guys are doing great so i'll be making bread today as i'm making this bread i will discuss with you guys what has been bothering me in my in my mind for a while now so let me talk to you guys about it so this cup is a, a one and a half measuring cup so which means i will be making uh, four cups of a uh, flour to i'll be using four cups of flour to make this bread yeah yeah because my daughter loves bread like a lot okay so lately i've been feeling uh feeling off like i don't know if i'm feeling if my feelings are right or or wrong so if i'm wrong you still let me know and those of you that uh, that will feel that i'm wrong with this my thinking you are right those of you that will also say i'm right with my thinking you are also right so everybody um we are entitled to to feel whatever way we want to feel yeah so i'll be adding this uh, sugar quantity of sugar to it so lately I wanted to, there is this special place I, I really want to, to walk. I really wanted to walk in this place. So when they helped me to, to contact them, the people say I can't walk in that place because of my keys, because they do shift, they do shift like night shift morning and afternoon um, afternoon shifts of which with children you can't walk uh, you as a mother you can't walk in such place sub uh, places so the thing is really making me feel done because i really wanted to work in that uh, in that company the it started 20 20 was it 2017 yeah 2017 i've been praying for work for a long time so actually when this work came out in 2017 i couldn't work as well because i was pregnant my my hormones were everywhere you know how the first trimester of a pregnancy is and to some of you that feel uh, energetic enough to do everything and anything, kudos to you people. Because for me, that first trimester of my daughter was really tough for me. I wasn't myself like at all. It was just uh, difficult for me to to even beat myself was difficult. I was having backache. All I just want to do is just sleep and sleep and sleep. That is the only thing that is interested to me i just want to to sleep that's all i'm coming guys so like i was saying i just want to sleep just sleep is the only thing is on my mind and when this work came out my friends that every one of us has been waiting for a job opportunity every one of them went in for the work this work was paying where they because then they were paying them like 1500 euros in a month so this is the yeast the yeast has proven like really well it did really well <laughs> let me add it to it so they went in for this uh, work i was excluded yeah because i was pregnant i really wanted to go and work home. but the the people that got the work for them said no you cannot go with your condition you have to you have to stay even in my mind i know that I can't do this uh, work. Not that the work is stressful. Not that the work is stressful. It's an, um, so they, ju they just didn't allow me to, to do the work because I'm pregnant and I wasn't myself. I wasn't strong to do the work at all. So, but that time I was waiting for work, yeah. But I don't have a particular place in mind to to work unlike this time that i have a particular place to to work i really wanted to to work to work in this place but because of my kids i can't work in that place so all i'm trying to see is that 
have you ever have you guys ever feel like regretting or i don't know don't get me wrong don't get me wrong let me not just pretend let me not pretend as if i didn't feel that way yeah there was a point in my life i actually felt uh, regretting that i have uh, i have keys not that keys are set back on no but there are some things there are some achievements achievements you 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 want to achieve but because you have keys it will slow the it will slow down the the process of the achievement so that is what i'm trying to say so you guys shouldn't get me wrong that uh i, I am regretting yeah yeah, I've, I've passed through that stage and it has gone. Yeah, long ago it has gone. So I'm no longer feeling uh, feeling that way. But I'm human. Just that I felt sad about the about the whole issue that because of my kids I can't walk in the in the place. So I was just feeling uh, really down. Let me say the truth. I'm feeling down because. This is a place I've been hiding for some time now that, oh, if I could get a, a work in this place, I'm okay because the work is not stressful like at all. It's not st uh, stressful. You know, when you see a work that is not stressful and you, 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 something just came up that you can't work in that place. I don't know if it's somehow and it pays well as well. So guys, let's uh, let's interact in the comment section. Have you guys ever felt that way, or if I'm feeling uh, uh, if my feeling is weird, I mean, if my feeling is weird, you guys should please let me know. Let me know what to do about it because of it. True, I've not been myself lately. Ever since I got the I got the news, I've not been myself. Because I really wanted to work in that place. So you guys should just let me let me know. Because like my friend, I was talking to my to my friend about this. She plainly said her own part that yes, at times a uh, uh, kiss uh, draw you back from some kind of things you want to do. Like yesterday I went to, to somewhere. I went to, to somewhere. I was rushing back to come and pick my kids from, from school because at the moment we are we are alone at the moment. There is no other person to pick them up except me. So I was rushing back from where I went to so that I can come and pick them up. So you know, mothers, most especially in this Europe that you don't have your family members around that can take care of these kids for you. So... You just have to do everything your everything yourself. It's a DIY thing. Do it yourself. Otherwise, you will just fall into a depression. Because that is that is how it feels like. A friend once told me that when she gave back to her uh, to her daughter, that she felt like throwing uh, her daughter through the through the window because she she was having this uh, blue moon. I don't know if I'm right, if it's Blue Moon, they, they call it, or... In fact, she nearly fell into uh, depression because of the... Because of the way the baby was crying. She don't want to sleep at night. Just uh, crying, being cranky, uh, cuddle with the, the, the colic the baby was having. So those... Those are the distress the mother was having there that then that made her think, oh, let me just throw this. Uh, guys, don't mind what is on it. It's just strawberry. My daughter used a, a spoon that she used to take strawberry to scoop a uh, butter. Yeah, that is why we are seeing that. Thing. And I don't want to remove it. Let it be there. <laughs> yeah. So, you guys, let us interact in the comment section. If you have ever felt that way, no, don't just um, don't just write a uh, rush to write. If you are not a mother, don't just write a uh, rush to write something to to discredit mother because you don't know what mothers are going going through. Until it get to your until you get to your turn, you will understand what I'm talking about. You know, everybody reacts differently to to things. 
There are some mothers, even though the the situation is overwhelming them, you don't see it in them. Why it's some people, it will tell all over them. Like for me, I'm not a confrontational somebody. I don't like confronting. Uh, I don't like confronting people, like at all. <laughs> I don't like but there are some time I, I I do confront uh, people but in my nature I'm not a confrontational uh, somebody instead of me to conf uh, confront you because of what you did I'll just let go if uh, if it is not something serious but if it is something serious I will try my best to let you know that what you did I don't just I don't like it so that you won't repeat that kind of uh, that kind of thing next time but in my nature i don't like confronting somebody i'll just let go of the of the things instead of going to confront the the person so guys i just want you guys to to interact with me in the comment section because i don't know the thing really hit me bad yeah it hit me so badly so i want us to to talk about it so guys that is what has been bothering me. I said, let me talk to you guys about it. This bread, I will show you guys um, the finishing because you know the process of making bread is so is so long. This one will take me like another another two hours to another two hours to make. So I will see you show you guys the end uh, end result and let's interact in the comment section. Okay, guys. Guys, the bread is ready. From those four cups of flour that I measured out earlier, though I lost count at some point, but it's okay. So this is the quantity of bread I got from it. Isn't it looking beautiful? I just finished rubbing um, butter on them for that shiny look you are seeing right now. I haven't tested them, but I know it will taste great. Luckily enough, I remember to show you guys the, the outcome of the bread. So see you guys. Bye everyone. Thank you for listening to me. Bye.